In Garen Justice's first year as head coach of the Concord football team, the Mountain Lions put themselves in position to win the WBIAC championship. In front of a packed house at Callahan Stadium on senior day, Concord defeated West Virginia Wesleyan 48-40 to capture the conference crown. Concord would use a Brian Kennedy 36-yard run to set them up inside the red zone. On third and two, quarterback Zach Grassi rolls out to the left, and that leaves tight end Rashid Baker wide open in the end zone for Concord's first score. After Wesleyan would score, Josh Miller comes up the middle and blocks a point after. Brian Kennedy would rip off another big run to push Concord across midfield, but the drive would stall out and Concord would turn the ball over on downs. Concord would set themselves up with good field position after Riyad Richardson returns the Wesleyan punt inside the 30. Grassi would find freshman receiver Ryan Stewart in the end zone, 14-6 Mountain Lions. The Bobcats would answer with their own score, making the score 14-13. Wesleyan quarterback Adam Nugenbauer would lead another touchdown drive to push Wesleyan ahead 20-14, but Concord responds as Grassi would find the end zone. Wesleyan would close out the first half scoring and taking a 27-21 lead into the locker room. The Bobcats would start the second half scoring with a touchdown. Running backs Brian Kennedy and Chris Rodriguez would account for the bulk of the yards on Concord's next drive. Grassi finds Stewart in the end zone for a second time, cutting Wesleyan's lead down to six. After a Wesleyan punt, the Mountain Lions drive the ball down the field, ending with a six-yard touchdown pass from Zach Grassi to fullback Gary Roach. The point after gives Concord a 35-34 lead. Concord's Aaron Martinez would intercept Nugabauer and set the offense up with great field position. A familiar side Grassi hitting Stewart for his third receiving touchdown of the day. Mountain Lions 42, Bobcats 34. Into the fourth quarter. With Concord clinging to an eight-point lead, the offense facing a third and 15, Kennedy takes the handoff and breaks off a 50-yard run. A few plays later, Kennedy would put the game away with his only touchdown of the game. Wesleyan would get a late touchdown, but it wasn't enough as senior Zach Gibbons intercepted Nugabauer's Hail Mary attempt and clinches the WVIAC championship for Concord. Garen Justice was the first rookie head coach to win the conference title. Wes McKinney talked with Coach Justice during the celebration. I couldn't tell you back play by play exactly what happened through the game. It was it was action packed, and, and Wesleyan's a great team, and they need commended because I mean they're number one offense in the country for a reason. And, but also, I feel very good about our defense. And uh, off offensively for us, it was great to see us finally come out and play some football. We've been seems like we've been saving it the whole year for the last game, and, and I'm glad they did. <laughs> Hindsight and uh, and defense have really shut it down. Dan. West McKinney caught up with running back Brian Kennedy after the game. It feels amazing. I mean, from 0 to 11 to conference champs, I never thought this day was going to come, but I'm glad I stuck it out in the senior years in football class. It's just amazing. Okay. It was Concord's first conference championship since 1990 and first ever as a member of the NCAA. They will travel this Saturday up to Pennsylvania to take on the Golden Bears of Cutstown University in the first round of the NCAA Division II playoffs. For Concord TV, I'm Emily Gallagher.